my Costco run day. Fun, huh? I'm gonna show you guys how to choose a watermelon. Did you know there's females and male watermelons? I'm gonna teach you something today. Okay, here we are. Do you see this? The lighter color versus, see that dark one right there? Okay, the lighter ones are females and that means they're sweeter. The dark ones are males. Of course, they're not as sweet as the females. The other trick to buying a good watermelon is, do you see this yellow right here? That means it sat and it's been sitting longer. So it's riper. It's gonna be a better option than one that doesn't have those dark, um, those white spots. It shows that it's been sitting on the ground longer. Wow. I don't know how you chose your watermelons in the past, but I used to choose my watermelons based on, I would knock on it <laughs> and see if it sounded hollow. If it sounded hollow, I was told that that meant it was good. And then I had an educational experience here at Costco by a lovely customer in Virginia. And she taught me how to choose a good watermelon. And it's worked every time. These chicken skewers are awesome. You can eat them cold. Um, I love these 24 grams of protein. No antibiotics. These are gonna go great with Caesar salad. This sounds really good. However, it has 46 grams of protein, or sorry, carbohydrates. I don't like that. Sugars are good, the fiber's good, but all those carbs is no bueno. Egg whites, always a must. And Costco, always. I just love the big box with all the containers. I typically try to stay under 100 carbs a day. So, that's why that one meal with 46 grams of carbs, that would be too many in one meal. That's why. These sound so good and they look super healthy, but they, you know, they have 16 grams of protein, three fibers, 12 whole grains. But then you look at this and it has 17 sugars. 17 is too many for what I'm doing. So we're gonna stick with this. I like to add my own berries into my yogurt. My stepdad wanted these. Two sugars, that's not bad. 22 carbs, four protein. <laughs> Oh, it's so nice to have my back of my Jeep clear to get groceries again. I need to make one more stop to a regular grocery store because they don't have, I'm making my protein bars and my protein bars 